All right, Suge Knight has accused Snoop Dogg of committing a crime to acquire ownership of Death Row Records. Knight questions whether Snoop is the true owner and claims the label's sale was illegal. He says he doubts Snoop's a claim of ownership and alleges that Harris committed bankruptcy fraud. Knight says he and his lawyers only discovered the fraud a week prior to a phone call with TMZ. Snoop acquired Death Row Records in a deal with MNRK Music Group back in February of 2022, but the terms were undisclosed. Oh, shit. Sure. Yeah, I mean, this is he just... He could have a point, though. You know, it could be true. I, I just think when you get to be like Snoop Dogg level, mm -hmm. uh, the the team that you have working for you mm -hmm. to evaluate every deal that you enter Knows into yeah. um, is probably turning over you know every stone mm -hmm. to make sure that there are no surprises mm -hmm. uh, like this. And so you know I don't know what information Suge Knight's getting in jail mm -hmm. <laughs> that Snoop Dogg doesn't have on the outside and, of jail. And, and Snoop Dogg is claiming it, wearing it, walking in it. He's got some great new young artists on the precipice of of, of breaking breaking wide and they sound good and they look good so he's doing his thing with death row for sure yeah